Hello guys, welcome back to Spice Channel TV. Thank you for always coming out here. If you're joining us for the first time, please kindly subscribe and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you. In a recent development, the white witches and wizards of Nigeria have issued a strong message to Atiku Abubakar, the People's Democratic Party PDP presidential candidate for the 2023 election. The white uh, witches and wizards of Nigeria, represented by their spokesperson, Ibo, have urged Atiku to seize what they view as a divisive and distracting pursuit and instead collaborate with President Bola Tinibu to address critical national issues. There are so many national issues, so many pressing national issues that need the attention of the likes of Atiku Abubakar. So, speaking to journalists in Lagos, expressed you know, concerned, one of their spokesmen over Atiku's ongoing efforts regarding the so-called fishing expenditure in the United States. According to the White Witches and Wizards Association of Nigeria, this endeavor is nothing more than a fatal exercise that would serve to squander both time and resources. The White Witches and Wizards Association of Nigeria's message to Atiku extends to the Labour Party presidential candidate Peter Obi, encouraging both candidates to join forces with President Tinibu so that they can build and rebuild this nation in a collective effort to rebuild the nation. The White Witches and Wizards Association of Nigeria acknowledges the challenges facing Tinibu's potential second term in office and has emphasized the importance of unity in addressing the issue affecting the House Rock. But then, they have also uh, warned Atiku, Alaji Atiku Abubakar of the PDP, against you know, emptying his aristocratic uh, pomposity, and that River State Governor Yinsong Wike will laugh last. So between Atiku and Wike, who is nursing the brutal heartbreak of a crushing defeat, who is smiling and who is garnishing teeth. The White Witches, White Witches and Wizards Association of Nigeria highlights the state contest in the parts taken by Atiku and Yenson Wike, the former River State Governor. One Wike was assumed a significant role as the minister of the FCT Abuja. Wike, Atiku appears to be preoccupied with a seeming failure uh, for to endeavor and according to articles pursuit of this case in the united states Ibo revealed that the white witches and wizards association of nigeria is closely monitoring the situation uh, is closely monitoring the situation akin to terrestrial law courts however their parliamentary findings suggest that articles efforts have been in uh, vain with both his time and his resources, they've been both, you know, squandered. And it comes in a time whereby, you know, as a team, they've urged Atiku, even uh, P2B, to team up with Tinibu to rebuild Nigeria, you know, to rebuild Nigeria. So, guys, what are your thoughts on this issue? The White Wishes and Wizards Association of Nigeria's message to Atiku Abubaka is clear. It is time to seize divisive actions and join hands together with President Tinibu and other leaders in addressing pressing social economic challenges facing Nigeria. The nation's future hangs on unity and collective hand. The outcome of the 2023 election remains on the vo remains on the people on the welfare of the people and the development of the nation okay guys what are your thoughts on this issue i mean this is really interesting that uh, the white witches and wizards association of nigeria actually sent a strong warning to um to atiku abubaka and p2b that this is what they are seeing oh, wouldn't it be best for them for Atiku, most especially, to quit his U.S. fishing expenditure 
expedition. They've urged him to cease. He should cease because it definitely would not take him anywhere. And this is what they are saying. This is the, 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 the request that they are making from both Atiku and Obi. So, this is a very, very serious matter. Now, the White Witches and Wizards Association of Nigeria has said Tinibu has won the election. And they are even saying on the second term for Tinibu, it will be 100% possible. It will be 100% possible. But then, they've questioned Atiku's uh, relentless effort, relentless pursuit to make sure he gets his hands on Tinibu's record and all of that. So according to, to the White Witches and Wizards Association of Nigeria, they have taken the center stage in the Nigerian politics. You know, these mysterious entities have claimed that, uh, that have claimed to have uncovered the truth about Atiku Abubakar's controversial U.S. expedition, and they are now urging him to cease what they consider a photo uh, endeavor. So guys, what are your thoughts on this issue? However, Nigerians have reacted. What are they even thinking? Why is it that now we are hoping for a better development that the witches and wizards are claiming to be in charge? It is end time more from the enemies of God. Not No good should be expected of them. The witches and wizards, your time is up. Now that the problems bed even in our country has been reviewed to us because Jehovah, the all-knowing creator of heaven and earth, is secretly and openly watching the destroyers of his great country. Okay, guys, these are just few reactions from Nigerians. So my country people, I'm dropping here. Kindly share your thoughts on this in the comment section. Thank you.